attendance problems reported at a Durham school tonight. The board is reporting a double-digit drop in attendance at Riverside High School. This follows immigration raids targeting students. WNCN's Mario Boone has that story. Well, a lot of activity here at the Durham Public Schools headquarters. The most significant development is the school board just voted to pass a resolution opposing the arrest of its students in the so-called immigration raids. Now, the move comes after this student, Wilden David Guillen Acosta, was arrested January 28th on his way to Riverside High School. His sister told me through a translator, Acosta entered the country illegally in 2014. His family says he escaped certain death at the hands of violent gangs in Honduras. Also developing tonight is this. Riverside High School is home to the largest Latino student population in the county, and we just learned that since these immigration raids, attendance has dropped by at least 20%. Now, I'm told students are simply too afraid to come back to school. This has caused serious, serious uh, harm to the entire community. It's terrorized everyone, and Wilden is, is still detained, and he face, faces imminent deportation. And back here outside the headquarters again. Now, we plan to check in with uh, school leaders over at Riverside tomorrow to uh, find out what attendance is looking like there. We are also told that the student in this particular instance, Acosta, is being held in Georgia, and plans are underway to deport him back to to Honduras. Reporting outside the Durham Public Schools headquarters, I'm Mario Boone, WNCN News Now.